Yo, 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 what up, what up? It's your boy Lamar, man. Back in here with another video. Um, basically, man, some stuff I want to talk to y'all about. So, a couple people, a people, couple of people have been asking me, who is Randy? Randy is a guy that a couple of people in my circle that we know. Randy is a real, real person. He just makes the dumbest decisions, man. Like, no cap, dude. He makes the, the worst dumb, dumb, dumb moves that I ever, that I ever hear him tell, man. It's like, this ignorant ass bastard, Randy, is trying, like, Basically, he tries to scam people. Basically, let's let's get that in the butt. He likes to scam people. He likes to get rich quick scheme scheme people. He likes to get rich. Anything that can make himself a buck at the end of the day. Pretty much. I'm just going to shoot to you straight. You know what I'm saying? He's a hustler. You know what I'm saying? He ain't got no job. You know what I'm saying? He's just trying to find ways to make a dollar. So, his car, he's got a, he's got a Chevy SS. So his car is pretty much down. The transmission is, is, is fucked in it. So explain to me, because this don't, this right here just doesn't make any fucking sense, okay? So it's basically like he's, he said, yeah, man, um, I'm getting my uh, car fixed for $1,000. I think myself, $1,000. I said, I said, how you getting your car fixed for $1,000? You know what I'm saying? And he's like, well, he bought the transmission for five hundred, and then the guy's putting it in for four fifty. No labor. Did you hear what I said? He said he paid five hundred for the transmission, and the guy's charging him four hundred and fifty dollars. And I'm just like, who in the fuck? It's going to charge that small of a price to put in a transmission and take one out. Like, that just doesn't make any fucking sense. And I said, um, I said, okay. So I, I asked him, I said, so, uh, how you going to pay for this? You, you ain't got no fucking job, so how you going to pay for it? Oh, man, well, you know, the, the, the I got paid to do a thousand dollars, then, um, my boy is going to send it over to the financial company and then they're going to uh, write us a check back and um, the the dude get his cut and I get, and, and I pretty much get my thousand dollars back and I and I just just sit there and listen and I'm just like the shit that he fucking says makes no fucking sense what so fucking ever you know what i'm saying so it's just like what the fuck so then i said how the fuck you get your shit fixed for so little price what fucking shop out there is going to charge that fucking low to put in a transmission and take one like i guess you know swap whatever it is you want to fucking call it you know what i'm saying just to put in a transmission take out a transmission it just, it just didn't fucking sound right with me. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just like, well, damn, Randy, in any way to make an easy buck out here, man. Like, damn, this nigga don't want to pay for his own shit half the damn time. Every time we go somewhere, we're paying for his fucking shit. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I know people hit hard times, you know, and stuff like that, you know, I've hit hard times, but, damn, man, the, the motherfucker is just straight ignorant, he's an ignorant ass motherfucker, man, like, how the fuck you gonna get your shit fixed for a thousand dollars, and then turn around and get that money back, like, what, the, it just, what shop do you know is gonna charge, usually shops are charging, what, four or five thousand, six, you know, how much it is, you know, for a transmission, you know, I don't know, you know what I'm saying, I never really had that, you know, a problem with transmissions, knock on wood, you know what I'm saying, 
But it's just the, the nigga always lying all the fucking time. You know what I'm saying? He's just always fucking lying, lie after lie. It's just a sh shit that he says just makes no fucking sense. You know what I'm saying? So basically, and another thing he said, he was like, um, yeah, man, um, so I'm getting my car fixed, and then they just going to tack it on to my loan. And I'm thinking, damn man, Randy, Randy, Randy is a, is a he, he's not a one of a kind. He's a stupid one of a kind ass niggas. That's what, that's what the fuck he is. You know what I'm saying? He's just, he's stupid. He's a stupid ass nigga. Like what the fuck? They know, uh, ain't nobody out here is going to charge $450 just to put in a transmission. There's just no way. There's no way that that anybody, I don't care who you are, is going to charge $450 to put in a transmission all, all in one. So basically, he, he bought the transmission, and then he's paying the guy $450. And I'm saying, but they both seven. I mean, I, I don't know, man. I don't I don't fucking know. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, who who is Randy? Yeah, that's who Randy is. He's a lying son of a bitch, if you ask me. I always try to get one. <laughs> I always try to get one over somebody. I always do. That's that's how he is, man. I always try to get over anything that make a at the a dollar at the end of the day. At the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker, just, I know, there ain't, ain't no way in hell that you're gonna spend a thousand dollars to get your car fixed. That's what everything, buying the transmission, paying him to put it in, all that shit, and then he's gonna uh, write it up and send it to your finance company, and then your finance company's gonna write him a check. That way he gets his, his, some of his money back and then you get your thousand dollars back i ain't never heard no shit like that man all right man oh the fuck randy like god damn man like are you two walls over stupid like what the fuck dude i ain't never heard no shit like that man never in my life dude like what the fuck man y'all let me know what y'all think man because this this shit right here just just don't make no fucking sense. Randy don't make any damn sense. Randy's real and he's a dumbass. Trying to make. Oh yeah, man. I'm gonna make my money back on my on, on fixing my car. Fuck that. Oh okay. Mm-hmm. Well, I hope you got the right transmission for your car, man. Cause I know how you like to. You like you don't like to pay full price for shit. Cheap bastard. That's why I told him last night. I said, "Man, you 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 like to find the easy way out." Fuck yeah, man. Oh, okay. Huh? See, so not gonna pay, pay pay full price for that transmission, man. Fuck nah, man. I'll cook him some barbecue. God damn. Yeah. You you kiss ass at work when you got a job. When you don't have a job, you know what I'm saying? You. you I'm just oh man, dude. Stupid ass nigga. Stupid ass nigga. Ain't got a job. I ain't gonna never get a job. You know what I'm saying? He only stays on the job for 30 days and he quit. You know. I mean, I know I did wrong by lying to him, but what the fuck? That just goes shows you a dumb ass nigga's gonna believe some, some shit like that. Like, what the fuck, man? Like, man. Shit, man. Y'all motherfuckers don't know Randy. Like, like I do. Like I know Randy. I've been knowing Randy for a long time. Hustling ass nigga. Man, I told him one time, man, I said, man, if you ever got somebody, if you ever hit the lottery, man, you going to jail for tax evasion. Cause that's what oh, oh he'll be like, oh man, I forgot to pay my taxes, man. You dumb motherfucker. Yeah, that's who Randy is, man. He's real. He's a real fucking person. He's stupid to all stupids. But damn, I ain't never heard no shit like that, man. 
oh, well, Dad, well, something go wrong with my car, so I'm just going to just, oh, just go to my financial company, and then they just go help me get it fixed and then tack it on to the back of my back of the loan. The fuck? Two kinds of stupid right there. Two kinds of fucking stupid. It ain't don't make no damn sense. But yeah, man, it's your boy Lamar, man. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.